talk to me about your your NFT project. So my friends for a while were actually trying to get me to do it, and I was like, I don't want to do added work. You mm-hmm. know, we were talking earlier about how the like so many subscription platforms like it's and they all want different content on there or they you know it's almost impossible sometimes so I was like I don't want to do this added work and then I wasn't working and that you know so uh, my friends I jumped on a little bit too late I feel but I also think I did it at the right time because um, I didn't have anything else to really do so I purposely wanted to give my fans something that you know like they can buy customs but then it's kind of like whatever and you know it will either get stolen or, you know, put up on tube sites. But I was like, I want to give them something that I think can hold value if they want to resell it. So they buy these NFTs and then they get like, you know, exclusive content, voice notes. Um, They honestly get like first out of everything. Like I have, um, you know, some some clothing and stuff that I am coming out with. I'm going to release it to them first. Mm -hmm. But if they don't like what I have on there, they could sell their NFT back mm-hmm. and get their money back. Mm-hmm. So, so what are what are the NFTs specifically? They're all variations of different stuff. You can even okay. get golden tickets where um, if you get one, um, you can get a free FaceTime call with me mm-hmm. or a, a Skype or something mm-hmm. like that. Mm-hmm. So they're all just different looks, and they, it's at random mm-hmm. which one you get. But So are they um, – because I understand that, like, NFTs in are really, like – kinds of member special like membership yeah. tokens really where yes. people can access bonus stuff like you're talking yes. about but your nfts specifically because you know they've sometimes they're cartoons yeah no they're, they're, so cartoon. they're, they're cartoons yeah. cartoons of you okay. yeah cartoon very girly mm-hmm. uh very similar to me so yeah. yeah i went with more of a cartoon look how many variations are there i think there's a thousand oh wow yeah yeah so there's quite a few so did you get to choose what each variation was or at least i mean because i know a lot of times with a thousand especially yeah. it's like maybe you swap out the hair hat color with the hat yeah. with the shoe and etc but you know there's got to be some basic designs that you work yeah on. You so I, I yeah i worked with a guy on just the basic ones mm-hmm. and um and they actually took a lot of it from my instagram the looks and stuff like mm-hmm. that so some of them are are kind of similar to photos where they kind of just drew up and and then, like we said, changed, you know, mm-hmm. the shoes or whatever. Mm-hmm. And um, you were featured in a Business Insider article um, that said you made 30K in one month. Was mm-hmm. that surprising to you? Was it more? Was it less than you expected? Uh, it, it was surprising because I did a smaller drop. So mm-hmm. I wanted, um, yeah, so I, I it was surprising because I didn't necessarily think people were still buying NFTs, but then I kind of thought about it. And I was like, I actually really do have hardcore fans that no matter what I do, I know that they'll like support. So it makes sense a little bit. Yeah. Yeah. It's, I mean, it's an interesting time to get into the NFT market, right? It is. Because the bubble has popped mm-hmm. um, and all of those useless NFTs and all of those rug pulls have yeah. been exposed. So, but, but however, there are still, there's still like a core group of people that really believe in NFTs and feel like it's going to come yeah. back around and, and believe in the project. So yeah, it's kind of like, I feel that if you're successful in that market at this time, then you're really, you know, providing value mm-hmm. and you have customers who recognize that and trust you really. I think if you have like a hardcore fan base your nfts will always be like something that people want to buy i think Mm -hmm. it's people buying these random ones that Mm -hmm. are like you know whatever that they were just like some type of weird character that no one there was no like substance to it you know so so i feel like mine will always be popular yeah i really do i think any girl in the industry anyone with a fan base their nfts will always do good as long, yeah, and I think as long as they are providing the value for that, right? Because mm-hmm. that's, I think that that's where the problem lies. Because right. a lot of people don't necessarily understand what NFTs are, and they think they're just like you know digital pictures. No, or you whatnot. get solos. You get yeah right. with mine, right? With mm-hmm. yours. So if you're delivering, and if you're actually you know following through on those deliverables, that's what makes I them am. valuable. And I think that's where. <laughs> People either succeed in that or they yeah. don't, you know? I mean, it is hard. 
like we said, it is hard to constantly put out content, but the, I, I promised them that I would, and it's no different than me shooting just one extra solo mm-hmm. each time I do all my other stuff. So, yeah. 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 I mean, it's, it's true. It's like, if you're already producing a large amount of just throw content. one extra one in there. Yeah. Yeah. It's fun to foresee myself to kind of s- stay relevant, you know? <laughs> yeah. And stay like committed. Yeah. Hey guys, if you want to support my show, then you should think about joining my Patreon. At my Patreon, I offer all kinds of amazing perks in exchange for your financial support. From live streams of my interviews as they are happening, to bonus Q and A's, behind the scenes photos and videos of my shoots, plus cool merch like stickers, mugs, and hoodies, we have you covered. So go to patreon.com slash hollyrandallunfiltered, and while you're at it, make sure that you click that subscribe button so you don't miss a single one of my new updates.